Oh my god, she's totally killing him! Hi, I'm Alex and welcome to my anime reaction channel. In the previous episode, we have learned a little bit about Yogiri's past. The candidates that survived the magical tower have been all granted an, a title of Knights of the Divine King. The barrier broke and the battle emerged, but the Divine King, released from her embrace, the Dark Lord, just fell into the water. Turns out Yogiri already took care of him a long time ago. I can't tell you about the massive scale of his powers. I can only imagine what's going to happen in this episode. So let's Let's do it. And don't forget to like and subscribe to help the channel grow. Thanks! Was that a UFO pod? Have you seen it? That was so strange. Oh, that's the Aoi. <laughs> of course he isn't human. He's the end of all fates. <laughs> I swear. The sound, the voice of the sword is so funny. <laughs> I can't think that's probably what he would say. Well, <laughs> that's because you've not actually met Yogiri and you have only one chance. <laughs> what is that key? Like a proper demonic key with tentacles coming out of it. Ugh, gross. <laughs> this guy has the most difficult from the all. He literally cannot do anything on his own. Was because he's such a nasty character as well, you know. This is not a game, mate. Eh? How can it just increase the friendship level? <laughs> yeah, you are a slave again, I think. Maybe she is a girl, who knows? I like this uh, king's voice, voice actor. Oh my god, he's missing his fingers. They will reattach once there's a distance between them. Well, that's interesting. By the way, I love Tomachika's design clubs. Well, duh. Exactly. Why does no one remember him? Oh, well, it's because most of the time he's just there in the background sleeping. <laughs> so that's the Divine King, right? Uh, well, that must have been like thousand years ago, girl, so everything has changed. I wonder if they will actually acknowledge her. She's not the ruler of this kingdom anymore. Yeah. So that's the ceiling key. Oh my god, why are they doing to her? Why are they stealing her? What's going on? And now you are realizing this. Well, thanks, no thanks. Yeah, well, obviously. I wonder if she's actually good or actually evil. I bet you anything she's actually evil and being sweet is just a facade. <laughs> oh well. <laughs> International Women's Day every day. Well, yeah, it's true though. He's not a loser, guys. He can just kill you on the spot. He told them that he can only kill the books? That's clever strategy, actually. He doesn't trust his classmates. Well, neither I would. It causes instant death to target. And he's a dark lord. Wow. 
That's interesting. Why do they call them Eroga... Eroga? Like... Eroga novels? How, like, hell it doesn't make sense, guys! <laughs> Why? <laughs> okay. Oh no! Oh my god, this is such a perverse! Oh yeah, they are. I no wonder they call them Eroga Masters. Like, I can see why. <gasps> oh no, that's the Samurai Girl and the Ninja Girl. How does he know his name? It's an actual Death God. What is he doing? Yeah, but why are you putting it on the table? Oh. Still, don't leave that eye on the table, that's creepy. Hello? Your eyes on the table? <laughs> oh, nobody wants a freaking eye. <laughs> Carol doesn't care. <laughs> eh, I don't think there's something you should be saying loud, right? That's what I mean. Oh, right. Her accent is so strange, she must be from abroad. There's more than that. <gasps> no, how can you ask her that? What? Well, she's alive and looking for you. The last. Oh, what? Oh wow! She somehow has Lane's. Wait, 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 wait! I need to stop now. So she has. So Lane Sama changed, turned her into a vampire, and now she has Lane Sama's powers for some reason. Because that was Lane Sama's power, wasn't it? So did she act it on? A reason or she wasn't aware of she's what she's doing like can someone in the comments please answer this question because I'm really curious now and this anime is so fast-paced now like we're literally moving from scene to scene from character to character that <laughs> that's why I had to stop the video because it's really easy to you know just forget about what is going on <laughs> and lose the track of things oh uh -huh. Well, X-ray vision. <laughs> yeah, I can see why they wouldn't want it to be used. Let's say if 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 Yagiri was involved in this power, that in this vow, I guess he couldn't be taken under the vow of Umbrella because that would restrict his powers and it would cause his defense. And like this person that has this power would die. But even if, like. There would be some sort of chain reaction, I'm sure of it. It would be a massacre. They literally cannot restrain his powers. Oh, you don't want to talk to her. She's nasty. Really? You're just going to follow the plot of this world? It's not even a game where you have to level up. <laughs> Obviously, she doesn't want to die. <laughs> Never mind. Where are they now? So, the, so Carol is like a support, so she can wear whatever she wants. It's not stupid though, you look great. I totally cosplay that. <laughs> Chill later. <laughs> Self center blacksmith. Wait, 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 wait. I need to, I need to, I need to go back. Because this is this is important. I, I haven't read it. She so Tomochika can create weapons and protective gear for her own personal use. That's great. I mean, look at her um, her armor. Looks fantastic. 
あなたのクラスエゴイスティックブラックスミスの力ですか No, she doesn't have that power, does she? Because this is, I'm pretty sure what she's wearing comes from that. What was the name of that thing? A scroll that her ancestor ghost gave her. Because that can act as her protective armor, right? Or as a shield. So they are thinking that she's a blacksmith. But I'm sure she's not. Is she? Oh god, I'm really confused because they haven't told us. I'm pretty sure she has she has no magic skills, but they think she has magic skills. So like they think that Yagiri has magical skills, but he doesn't. He actually he doesn't just kill bugs, you know. He kill he kill everything. Like they'll be so shocked when they, once they find out that they don't actually have magical powers. But Tomochika has martial arts skills. Her ancestor is granting her some certain items to power her up, like this armor. And yeah, Yagiru is just a death. Worse than death. The end of all fates. <laughs> so they called it. Enough of me talking. Oh, there's the third master. Handsome boy. I think he likes Tomochika. Correct me if I'm wrong. Okay. Cool. I mean, they are not bad at it. Hidden Prince. Go for it! <gasps> she can materialize weapons! <laughs> He's amazing! <laughs> Where did she have time to train? Oh, he can see the line of murderous intent. Wow, that's great. That's how he can hide his real powers. It's amazing that he can see that. He has to be careful because he doesn't want things just to die because they tried to attack him. <laughs> well, actually, he's doing even more than that, you know. I can't believe they've said that I want to see his bug-like powers. That is so silly. <laughs> he just called it a bug-killing power, but it's actually the ability that he just didn't tell them, right? <laughs> I mean, they just didn't understand what it actually is. They think it's a bug-killing power, but he can kill everyone. <laughs> it's hilarious. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, so that's the demon. Uh, well, since she looks like, uh, well, he looks like a girl, I'm sure he'll be fine. Yeah, exactly. Be careful. She can like proper kill you like that. Oh, that is the real vampires. It's just that she reversed into a young body. It looks like she has no recollections of her real powers. And she recognized her. She totally recognized her. And she's like so willing to serve her even though she is the origin blood now. That's interesting. She's so powerful. She doesn't have to serve no one. Oh. I hope they're not gonna see him because they will totally recognize him. But well, that's a convenient power, I could do with that, especially when I go to a gym that is super overcrowded, I just don't want people to see me. Because you are so creepy. Oh, isn't this the girl that was trying, like, survive, their classmate? Shit, it's her. Oh my god, she's totally killing him! Well, that's the one creepy power. Coming from his hand. She is a killing machine now. For reals. And the boy is dead. 
Wow. Oh wow. <laughs> She's so serious. <gasps> She's going to kill everyone. She's coming for you too. <laughs> well, obviously. <laughs> He's saying Sian. And what's she doing there? I hate her calm and quiet and sweet voice when we know that she's a proper creepy character. Oh, how unfortunate! Oh my god, everyone are so interested in Yogiri. Well, then you will be immediately disposed yourself. Please. <laughs> like, please. <laughs> Heat ray transforms people into things. And somehow she just created more cream? That is so strange. I don't quite understand it. Cheeky. She's totally telling them. <laughs> OMG, she's totally nuts. Yeah. Heat Ray, that's her power. Is that her only power? How far does it go? Mm, not bad and quite quick as well. Oh, that's the another dark god uh, down there. I don't think she would kill Tomochika because I just don't think she would. Oh no. A transporter? Okay. <laughs> Well, that's very useful. He's really clever with that. Oh, really? And you're not gonna do it yourself because you're too scared? <laughs> Boy, Boy, you are so dead. <laughs> Guys, honestly, interesting episode. And I have so many questions. So if you watched this video and you read the manga, I know you know actually what is going on. Tomochika was faking her blacksmith powers, wasn't she? She's just using the armor given her by her ancestor from the scroll. And what is this ability of Sion the Sage, the, the heat ray? I'm really curious. How does it actually work? And why did she, why did she just plop that whipped cream on him? That is so weird. To be fair, I, I kind, kind of, kind of made me perhaps somewhere there understand. Um, no, I, I, I don't. It's so weird. Anyways, I'm curious as to what is going to happen in the next episode. Make sure to smash the like button, subscribe for my future reactions, and if you would like to see my reactions uncut in full opacity and length, early released, the link to my Patreon is down below. Alternatively, you can become a member of my channel and get some amazing perks. Again, listen to the link down below, so make sure to check that out. A big shout out to my Patreon, Isaac, being a Shogun member of my Patreon and always supporting and commenting on my videos. Thank you so much to the members of my YouTube channel as well and anyone else who contributes to this channel growth. Have a fantastic day and thank you so much for watching the video with me. Hope to see you in my next video. Bye!